Seven twelve on WTIC. Sam's back with more in a bit. Uh, of course, as you know, it is Saturday, and as we often do, noted motivational speaker, uh, corporate consultant, and uh, just by and large a Renaissance man uh, is here bearing donuts from Luke's Donuts in West uh, in West Avon, uh, the official donut purveyor of the uh, Saturday morning show. So I want, I want to thank Ali and the gang over there for doing a tremendous job, as always. The flawless donuts. Uh, they're not just for breakfast anymore, by the way. So I just want you to know that. And they're also, sir, I also know Ali has a sign out there. He's doing cheeseburgers now and stuff. Oh, you know what I'm doing tomorrow? Tomorrow, tomorrow I have to do, I'm doing an appearance out in Meriden at the Four Points. It's a home show. Then I'm there from 11 till 1. Yes. But after that, guess where I'm going? I'm going to be in Meriden. Uh-oh. I'm going to Ted's Steam Cheeseburgers. <laughs> I've never been to Ted's. I've got to go to Ted's. I've driven by, this never stopped it. in. Now I'm going. Moment. So I'm looking forward to that. I got that going for me, which is nice. Uh, there are other things. But see, that's it. This is a time of change, and that's what we're talking about today. It is. Birds are freshening up their plumage. Trees are putting on new leaves. Flowers are surprising us. Spring is bursting forth with a new look. Are you? Freshen up your perspective and creativity with a new self-image. A great video is posted for you this morning at MyValueTree.com of Erica Van Pelt's incredible transformation on american idol to show you what's possible wake up get ready star power right after weather and sports all right it's a 714 wtic all right 722 is the time on wtic and it's time now to go to school children uh, time for today's episode of star power to make you uh help you get through these trying times of high gasoline prices though according to the current this morning that's actually a sign of a stronger economy so okay I'll, I'll go with it. Uh, anyway, here's where we are. This is, you know, can't do anything about that, but you can do something about you. And that's why Alden Davis is here, and Alden, have at it. Well, refresh your perspective and creative energy this spring with a new look. The birds have new plumage, the trees are sporting new leaves, and flowers are giving us dots of new color. What about you? Coming out of winter's hibernation can leave many people a bit sluggish, pasty, and dull. And our creative energy, dusty headed. Well, maybe it's time to shake yourself awake with a spring makeover as a way to get into a happy state with a positive self-image. In the publication Human Performance 1998, Tim Judge et al. put forth their research showing a strong correlation between positive self-concept and job performance. In 2008, in the Psychological Bulletin, a group of professors from the University of Amsterdam looked at 25 years' worth of research on the link between mood and creativity. Quote, to survive, people need to adapt to changing circumstances. There you go. To prosper, people need to solve problems, generate new insights, and create new products and services. Put differently, critical to both survival and prosperity is creativity, the creation of something new and unusual meant to improve one's effective functioning, end quote. After synthesizing 102 different research projects on the relation between mood and creativity, it was revealed that positive moods produce more creativity. So what does it take to reshape your self-concept and improve your mood? Coach is offering that today is the day to shed your hibernation look and kick it up a notch. Let's use our looks as a catalyst for renewed performance. Did any of you get a chance to see American Idol this week? Since the tone of judging changed, I enjoy dropping in to see the singers transform into entertainers and performers. Well, this week was one of the biggest transformations ever. Erica Van Pelt, 26 years old, with shoulder-length blonde hair and red highlights. Tommy Hilfiger was brought in to work with the contestants on their style, and he suggested a bold change. Create a more distinctive, edgy look and accentuate your face with a totally new haircut. She agreed, and the before-after look is stunning. Her appearance was so starkly changed that Jennifer Lopez did not recognize her when she first walked on stage. She actually looked like an entertainer, tight and put together. The nondescript blonde hair was now black, short, and styled atop black pants and blouse. The judges were blown away. This transformation of looks happened overnight. I posted a video of her at change at myvaluetree.com. Mm-hmm. It is well worth the look to see what is possible. You can refresh your perspective and jumpstart your creativity just as quickly. Matter of fact, you can do it today. The only thing holding you back is your tolerance for what other people will say. Coach says, be daring. Today is the day to shake things up and renew your perspective. For years, I worked in a setting where dark suits were the norm. There was not a lot of room 
or color or fabric variation. A big change for me was switching from regular ties to bow ties. While this may not be a huge sartorial step, let me tell you, it gets attention. People look, people comment, you definitely stand out. But every time I put on a bow tie, I am keenly aware of a change in my creative state. For some of you, just a change of makeup would shake things up. My daughter had a great experience with the cosmetologist at Laura Mercier. They went over uh, their three-part approach to perfect complexion and how to pick the right base for your color undertones. They showed uh, different styles for eyeliner and shadow. It's a great boost to one's self-esteem to look good. And as the research suggests, there is a positive relationship between self-concept and job performance. Be open to help in determining your options. Tell your hairstylist you're ready to shake things up and ask them what they would do. It's only hair. Live large. <laughs> take a chance. For a couple of seasons, Coach put blonde highlights in his hair. It was great fun and created a new presence for me. Just as Erica made a step function shift in her appearance with a new do, so can you. It's an easy way to refresh your perspective on the world by giving you a new face to look at each morning. <clears throat> Feel good about yourself and create a renewed sense of vibrancy this spring. So many people are working hard for so long hours. It's too easy to get stuck. Take advantage of spring's energy for your own renewal. Had a beard for 20 years? Shave it. Clean shaven forever? Sport of Van Dyke. Never wear eyeshadow? Start. Long hair, go short. Short hair, go long. <laughs> Straight tie to bow tie. Yeah. No scarf to scarf. Hair going gray? Dye it. Add some highlights. Change your glasses. Try a bold lipstick color. Don't try to sneak the change in so no one notices. The point is renewal. Is spring subtle about its arrival? No, it bursts on the scene with bold colors and full voice singing. Don't be scared of dull people. Wear some bold colors and strong prints. Last season, I got some Bugatti Umo shirts that are anything but subtle, and I love them. I feel good every time I put one on, mm. even now. Mm. Seize the day. Spring into action. Renew your creativity with a new look. I'm Coach Davis. Well, that's good. That's very good. I like that. So just go crazy. Is that one of those Bruno whatever they are? This is a Bugatti Umo right here. That's very nice. Isn't that? It's got a little sports, a little color there. It does. I actually had somebody stripes, say you know? they uh, this, the shirts were uh, too loud for them to wear. They weren't ready for them. What's the uh, fabric? What do we? Do? Oh, this is just a nice cotton. Just nice cotton. Yeah, but okay. it's got a. Uh, they've done a really great job with the print on them. Oh, they have. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's very nice. Oh, uh, very nice. So, and you know, you got the blazer, so it kind of works with that. It, 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 <laughs> well, no, no, no. It yeah, says the, you know, the blazer crazy keeps and, the image. Yeah. But the undertones, right, are there. Well, I think it's a clear – I think a lot of people don't want to send a clear message that they've changed, but maybe that's not a bad thing. Well, that's like, you, you know, do. look at spring, really. Does so you don't want to, to sneak up on him. You want to come in and just say, hey, it's a whole I, new me. That's right. You know, these guys that try to um, use that Grecian formula and let their hair go slightly yeah. back, just do it. Make a statement. I used to work with one guy. It was great. He was probably 40 at the time. Yeah. He'd let his hair grow the entire year. Okay. Oh and then my. he'd shave it all off at the start of the year. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know, it's Kind of like harvest, yeah. Right. <laughs> and then sell it, you know, for to a wig company, yeah. But, folks, it's just time. There, if you feel good, you know, the research shows good links between creativity and your mood. Put yourself in a good mood. Shake it up. Take advantage of spring. These so are words, small so changes. Words, you know, creativity starts with yourself. So how can you be, you know, you want to change the world, well, change yourself, and that's the beginning well, of it's the a, well, process. Great way to say it. Let yeah. me tell you, a new stick of lipstick just wouldn't hurt. <laughs> <laughs> well, I did want to do this one time. I, did, I thought one morning I'd just, uh, you know, get, get some, like, hair dye and just go totally black. <laughs> <laughs> See if anybody knows. Oh, it'd be shocking. It would be. Well, but, and some lady who works for some hair color just for men or something brought in like a whole basket full of these things. You know things. what? And I who cares? It. It's only hair. You think you noticed? <laughs> <laughs> think you noticed? All right. It's uh. But see, sometimes you got to make it. It's got to work well. Never mind. It's a seven thirty on W. I've got Andy Rooney eyebrows, so you know I got to mm. think about that. Take too. the leap, Ray. Yeah. Go big. It's a seven thirty on WTIC. And now, ladies and gentlemen, you know what it's time for news. 